Hello and welcome to another episode of Game On. I'm your host, Slash Raptor, and today we're going to be continuing playing Paper Mario. I just took a nap, so now I've got to take off all of these badges that I don't need anymore. Like, for example, the Defend Plus, and I can exchange it for the Power Plus badge. And so now I'm instantly going to do more damage by one whole point, which is just going to be so much useful. But unfortunately, in order to have that, I have to I have to take off everything else, which is what I'm talking about when I say the Power Plus badge is very difficult to, to manage, because it's like six whole points just gone. And the Quick Change badge is also a really big sucker. But the Double Dip badge, that will really be useful. And quick Change is just awesome. In close call, you really want to have that on. So I really can't afford to put on anything else. Which is going to be difficult. But there's not very many spiked enemies in this next area. So my next level will have to likely go towards BP. Um, but yeah. So we're ready to go back down now. And uh, yeah. I've still got a decent amount of items. Which is more than enough to make my way through this next area here. Now that Anti-Guy is gone, most of the major threats in this particular area are gone. Because Anti-Guy is really, really tough. He's a great difficulty. Excellent challenge. So now, in true Mario fashion, or in true Game On fashion, I'm just going to take make a quick stop over here and gather up some, um, some more cake mix. And then we'll head, and then we'll head out. Ah, get back here! Ha ha! You fell forward, hook, line, and stinker. Three, three. See, look at that. Beautiful. I think the power plus badge only affects Mario though, because Bow is still doing one with her smack attacks. Spill will decrease the damage you receive. Nothing! Ha <laughs> ha! Die! Die! Smack him silly! Two star points! Which means that we're gonna have a hell of a time getting to our next level because the Shy Guys themselves are already giving me just two. No, just one each. I'll smack you so hard, you won't remember yesterday. Oh, how did I miss that entirely? Oh, I missed it again. Oh, terrible. I'm really sucking right now. Smack you so hard! I'm not entirely sure, but I'm I'm hoping that I'm only getting two star points, or one star point each, from the basic Shy Guys. Like, some of the newer, different kinds that we haven't seen yet um, might give us more, but I doubt it. But there is still a mini-boss that we haven't fought yet, and there's also still the big boss of this chapter, so we can always hope that they'll give us something. Like, these Groove Guys, they're the, exactly the same as Shy Guys, except they've got one more. They've got... They, they look different than how they attack, but maybe I'll get one, maybe I'll get two. Let's find out. Two! Good. So it's just the basic Shy Guys that are giving me one right now. Mario's dazed and can't move because I don't have enough BP to put on my, uh, my Feeling Fine badge, which is what I'm talking about when I say that the Power Plus badge is so double-sided. Like when you get to... When you get to the Crystal Palace later on in the game, get the Power Plus, the PFD down, and the D down, PF badges, and put PFD down on. And then just pick a different badge that you can use to make up for the, 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 less, the one less defense point. But for now, um, the Power Plus is the best thing we can, is all we can do, really. So, ah, uh, he caught me again. 
hell with this. Star Storm! Three points. Okay, so now let's go over here and bring out Goombario. Save over here. And go over this way. And now let's take a trip to Pink Station. Ta-da! And here we are. So yeah, let's let's go look around. Boing. So over this way, we've got more enemies to fight. And there's our first view of the of the fire guys. Oh yes, made the first strike. See, these guys here should still give me the same amount of stuff. But these spy guys, if they hit you with that hammer, they can disable one of your moves, so you really want to be careful with them. Nice! Die! Die! Oh, oh wow! Six whole star points for me? Wow, Merle, you shouldn't have had. You shouldn't have. I really hope I can get one of those on the boss battles because that would just be amazing. Oh my god, that is a big shy guy. Everybody calls me Gourmet Guy. I don't know why. It's just I'm just an ordinary food loving shy guy. I'm hungry. What a shock. Here, have some cake. His lips are making good. Mm. Yum. I don't want that cookbook. It's annoying. Ha! I made the first strike. Bonk. He can attack these guys. Nice! Oh yeah! Six points! I got a dizzy dial! Darn it. 
I have no choice but to hide. Out of sight. Because they're going to keep trying to attack me. And they would have killed me because I can't move right now. Which is one of the essential things about that quick change thing. Because I would have literally died if they hadn't done that. If I hadn't done that. Lucky! Super Shroom! I mean, Hot Shroom! so you can't keep doing that to me. Oh good, decrease the damage I receive. That'll help out, because I can't block any attacks in this turn. <laughs> Just what I needed. for that whole thing though. Wow. That was that was really bad. But anyway folks, that's about it for this episode of Game On. Thank you for joining me and I will hope to see you guys right back here in the next episode where we will continue playing from this point in the game. So until then, peace out and game on. Bye-bye. <laughs>